1979, the VCA compressor changed the sound of modern records forever. In this video, I'm going to show you how to set up a VCA compressor using the Vertigo VSE2 from Brainworks and why it's the secret weapon behind hit records. My name is Alex. Let's begin. I'm as cold as can be. The VSC2 from Vertigo is a VCA compressor used for mixing and mastering. And it features the most commonly used parameters on a compressor, such as threshold, ratio, soft being the most gentle setting, to break being the most aggressive, and attack and release settings. The attack has a fastest setting of 0.1 milliseconds to 30 milliseconds being the slowest. And the release is the fastest at 0.1 seconds, which is 100 milliseconds to auto mode. You have gain makeup to compensate for any volume loss due to compression, a bypass switch for both channels. And you can also engage this compressor in stereo mode where the left and right channels are linked or mono mode where they're independent from each other. What I personally like about this plugin, especially with bass heavy music, is the built-in sidechain filter. You can set this to 60 hertz or 90 hertz. And this allows the low end to cut through the mix without it being squashed or without over triggering the compressor. And you have your power switch. So let's take this back to the top and hear what the VCA compressor sounds in its extreme settings, and then we'll dial it back. Here we go. I never said the world revolves around me, but it might as well. I'm as cool as can be. Uh, I made myself a promise at 18. So those are extreme settings, probably not the best for this type of music. However, you can hear some of the distortion characteristics being pulled from the VCA, especially on the vocals. All right, good. So let's dial this back to some more moderate settings. Let's try a 41 ratio with an attack setting at 10 milliseconds and the fastest release. Some friends will turn on you. They got your back until the world's on you. I live life on my own terms and I write with my own words. Now you can't be everything to everybody. If you do, you look just at the self-worth. And everybody's got the same destiny, so it don't matter who's looking fly in the dirt. And if you talk about you in the field and they don't pay your bills, then why would it even hurt? Oh, but the banks Okay, so this sounds like a compressor. You can definitely tell that it's compressing the music. But again, it's a little bit too aggressive. So we'll dial it back even more. We'll use a lower ratio. We'll set it to soft, slower attack setting. We'll leave the release the same. And this time, what we're going to do is we're going to engage the sidechain filter. So this allows the low end, the kick, and the bass to cut through the mix without it being squashed. Here we go. I never said the world revolves around me. But it might as well, I'm as cool as can be. Uh, I made myself a promise at 18. I ain't on mind what to say about me. So, who I think you judge me? Nobody. Now, who can do what I do? Nobody. Now, which one of y'all can judge me? Nobody. And who I said God. So with these settings, the compressor is a little bit smoother. It's more gentle. Let's see if we can drive some more gain reduction out of it. Everybody's got the same destiny, so it don't matter who's looking fly in the dirt. 
and if you talk about you on the field. So I like what it's doing, especially with the pads and the keys, because it's bringing them up forward in the mix. However, it's squashing the kick a little bit too much. So we're gonna use a threshold where we're getting about 1.5 to about 2 dB of gain reduction. And then we'll use the makeup gain here to compensate for the volume. Another thing I wanna point out is the stereo versus mono. When we switch this to mono, the left and right channels are independent. So that means if there's like some kind of sound effect or trigger on one side, it's not gonna trigger the other side. Let's see if we can distinguish that. So that's all the time that we have for this video. I hope you gained some tips and insights on how to set up your VCA compressor. If you want to try out the VSC2, I invite you to pluginalliance.com to download a fully functional demo. As well, hit subscribe, hit like, leave me a comment below, and I'll see you guys again real soon.